What is going on there, citizens of the Reject Nation? We're going to watch Brooklyn Nine-Nine today. Something episode 99? Oh, episode 9. 99. Okay, whatever. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> leave a like on this video. That would mean a lot. Subscribe. Click the notification bell to get notified when our reaction for the next episode of Benign is up. You know about our Patreon. We don't need to tell you about it. All righty. Let's get to it. Sergeant Terrence Jeffords. Four years ago on this exact date, you told me I was too old to learn how to do the worm. <laughs> God damn. As I was telling the squad, our old CO, Captain McGintley, just passed away. Oh, no. <laughs> I'll have the travel details later. Hey, has anyone seen a worm? Because this funky chicken's hungry. Charles, a man has died. Read the room. <laughs> Embarrassing. Flat out embarrassing. Sad day. It's crazy how different things were when McGintley was captain. It's like the Wild West. Oh, yeah. We had some fun. I didn't. In every one of those photos, I look uptight and worried. Whoa. Jake, am I too high strung? I wouldn't say you're too high strung. You just are high strung. You know, you're strung is what makes you strong. You're strung strongly. <laughs> so where's the party at? Trick question. The party's right here, boy. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> Aww. Funerals are a meat market. Sadness is a powerful aphrodisiac. No, it's not. Then how come everyone cries during sex? <laughs> Commissioner is retiring next year. They put a short list together of possible replacements, and you're on it. This is your first interview. Really? Damn, dude. What's going on is Captain Holt has an interview to become the commissioner of the friggin' NYPD. Ooh. Who says I'm even interested in becoming commissioner? You, constantly, including the first day I met you. I'm interested in becoming commissioner. Good to know. Whoa. Wow, that was real. Please calm down. Right, totally don't want to jinx it. I don't believe in jinxes. Great, then you won't mind me saying it's a lock. You're definitely going to get it. And you're going to spell even better with that Lord High Commander of All Justice stank on you. Let's do this. This route is more direct. No, oh, okay, you do you, Kamish. Please don't call me that. Okay, fine, I'll just call you the Mish. No, wait, Mishy Elliot. No, wait, oh. Mish's Doubtfire. Oh my god! Uh -huh. What is it? Nakatomi Plaza. Oh. <gasps> the building from Die Hard. Can we go in? Can we pay our specs? Oh, our flight leaves in three and a half hours, and but it's like, what is time even? Hashtag <laughs> legalize it. <laughs> Argyle. Sorry? This is the name of the driver in the movie. We're going to Nakatomi Plaza. There's going to be role play. <laughs> it's even more beautiful than I imagined. It's an empty floor that's under construction. Just like in the movie. <gasps> this is the floor that John McClane ran on with his bare feet. Take my picture with it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. Okay, all 600 of these are great. We should probably head to the airport. All right, let's get out of here. Are you, are you sure about that? The door is locked. That's strange. I thought the guard propped it open. I kicked my way out, but I think these windows are bulletproof. Ah, we're not getting any reception in here. Hi. Kick the door open. Ah! All right, everybody, just calm down. I'm sure that guard will be back in like five minutes. We're going to miss our flight. I should be sitting next to a semi-famous person that I can't quite place right now. Come on. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> You guys okay up here? Yes! See? I told you not to give up hope. It's a miracle. We're still gonna make it! Yeah, we missed our flight by a lot. Oh. Let's see. Next flight. Cancel. 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 What is going on? There are huge storms in the Midwest. All flights are grounded. <gasps> oh, man. But at least you're not gonna crash in a storm. Now we have until Monday morning, and it takes 48 hours to drive from L.A. to New York. We've still got time. No, we don't. Woof. There are no available vehicles. I'm just gonna have to call the commissioner, cancel this meeting. No, not on my watch. We just have to think. There's gotta be a way to get you back. Commandeer a vehicle. Got it. May I present to you the finest RV that not much money can buy. The American Creeper. <laughs> Let's get creeping. Let's do this. They're already in Los Angeles. Are they leaving Los Angeles? They're going from Los yeah, Angeles. Yeah, right. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> That's where the Nakatomi Plaza Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I had, to, I had to take a second too. So what are you going to do in your commish? I think you should focus on interagency communication and intel sharing. Also, laser jails. <laughs> well, I'd like to see an increase in vacation days. And we should all get summers off like teachers. Let the city go to purge. Yeah. <laughs> Dallas? What the hell? We're supposed to be in Louisiana by now. Damn it! Speedometer's broken. No wonder everyone was flipping us off. I thought it was just racism. Well, I'm sure it didn't help. Yeah. I'm sorry. I don't think we can make it with time. I feel like he doesn't want to make it. Uh, from now on, 
we use the bathroom in the RV. No! There's so this. many of us. I know, I'm sorry, but it's the only way. Me first. Yep. You guys didn't hear that, did you? I'm still hearing it. I'm never gonna stop hearing it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not comfortable operating this vehicle at a speed greater than the prevailing road and traffic conditions. Fine, I'll do it myself. This is going great. <laughs> Oh man. <laughs> I definitely smell smoke. Pull over right now. I checked everywhere. Nothing's on fire. Nothing's even smoldering. We just wasted 10 minutes for no reason. Oh! We have to focus and think of a new plan for getting Holt back for his interview. Well, perhaps we should just focus on finding a place to sleep tonight. How far is it to Mansford, Texas? Like half an hour? Great. I have cousins there. There's a boil in every state. Oh, jeez. Tommy Becca! Becca is a man. Oh, thank you so much for letting us stay here. Galen Howard. I'd much rather be hanging out with you. What are you doing, Boyle? Just bringing you some water. Thanks. Mm -hmm. So, uh, who are you talking to? Is that your mystery hunk? Babe, are you all right? <gasps> oh, yeah. I'm dating a woman. I'm bi. Oh, that's great, Rose. I just want you to know that I totally support you. I don't want to talk about it right now, okay? Just leave it alone. That's not very Christian of her. No. I know you always hoped that you'd be commissioner. No. Over the course of my career, I've learned that it's best not to have hopes. It's like saying it's best not to have dreams. I only have one dream a year, always on tax day. In it, I must file an extension. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for trying. But deep down, I always knew I'd never be commissioner. All my dreams start with my stepsister painting her house. And Dan, uh, the house looking great? No. Oh, sex. Yep, you knew it. <laughs> There's a huge fulfillment center there. There is? Yes, Charles. I called them and they ship their packages out of a regional airport. They do? That's too much. Maybe back off a little bit. <laughs> the point is, we get to fly in the back of a cargo plane to Philadelphia. But well, we've been in these clothes since Friday. We smell like butt. I guess we'll just have to borrow some. From who? Yes. yes. Killing it. No! Sleep! To Brooklyn! Yeah. We look so cool right now. I feel like we're in a Mervin's commercial. Uh, I'm Mervin! <laughs> yep. Yeah, it's terrifying, but it doesn't matter because we're almost to the airport. Oh, no. What? No, why? Just because we're eight people standing in the back of a cab? Oh, they look like illegals. We got a tip saying there were drugs being moved in the back of a gray... Never mind. <laughs> this is a bovine brothel. Who called this tip in? It's impossible to say. They said the drugs are in the back of a bovine transport unit? Who calls it that? Everyone, that's what they're called. <gasps> Damn. And you're the only robot I know, sir. Bovine transport unit. Meat morp. Z. <laughs> Let me see your phone. I want to see your call history. No. Let me see it. No. no. Oh, damn. 25 minutes ago, outgoing call to 911. You sabotaged us, Mr. Robot. You called the pigs on us? <laughs> the pigs. <laughs> you drove by Nakatomi Plaza on purpose, didn't you? And then you trapped us in there, didn't you? Fine. I did. Over here is the elevator where McLean put the now I'm. Yeah. Take my picture with it. And there were plenty of rental cars at the airport, weren't there? Hundreds. And you. <laughs> Did you blow up the creeper? Not on purpose. <gasps> Ouch. I realized your revolting cheese puffs were made with some extremely unstable chemicals. I deposited a few in the gas tank. I thought they'd shut the engine down. I didn't realize they'd ignite it. <laughs> Whoa. I made a decision a while ago, and now some people are holding it over my head. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> I, was <w> <laughs> I was wondering if that would ever come back. Seamus Murphy, the gangster, he offered me info that would get you and Rosa out of prison in exchange for a favor. Oh my god, you did all of this for us? I love you, Dapton. 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 The first thing that you taught me when you came to the 9-9 is that we're a team. So your responsibility is my responsibility, too. And mine. And mine. And mine. And my, and my ex. <laughs> oh, Captain, my captain. Remember that time we went to the deli for cold cuts and the ticket <laughs> machine was broken, so you found out what time everyone arrived and made them get in a single file line from earliest to latest? Yeah. Higher. Uh, <laughs> you might want to stand back for this, sir. It can get pretty intense. <laughs> oh. Our union health plan has 100% reimbursement for out-of-state ambulance rides. Scully will fake a medical emergency. Don't need to fake it. Always having at least one. <laughs> 
Ambulance can drive 25 miles over the posted speed limit, so we'll get there by 9 p.m. There's a small airport there, but thanks to a loophole in HR 377551, <laughs> we'll land at an airstrip outside of Finksburg, Maryland. We take a cab to Baltimore, jump on the 6.40 a.m. train to New York, arriving at 9.26. Kevin will meet us at Penn Station with a fresh captain's uniform. From there, it's a 29-minute cab ride to one police plaza. You change on the way, and we should get to your meeting Jesus. with five minutes to spare. Please. That was a monologue. We gotta move, move, move! Ah. I love her. Also, bovine brothel, name of your sex tape. Slam! Jump Brooklyn! We did it! We did it! Peralta, yeah. thank you for not quitting on me. It was all him. <laughs> yep. <laughs> You're first class mint. I know how important this is to you. You know what really makes a trip first class? Terry, we don't really have time for a speech right now. They're fine, your breath sucks. Just pop it and go! Drink this instead. A mimosa! Aww. I'm sorry, it's so nosy. I actually felt really good to tell somebody on the squad finally. I'm glad it was you. All right. Aww. My hat is in the ring for commissioner. Yeah! I still don't know how we're going to deal with the Murphy complication. Laser jails. But, you know, we'll figure it out. Nine, nine! Nine, nine! 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 nine. nine. <laughs> <laughs> There's always that very particular pronunciation. <laughs> that was fun. That was fun. Wow, Rose is bisexual. This changes everything. So hot. That's right, man. It's for it's for us. But if a, a guy is bi, it means he's just gay. Yeah, it's true. He's that's what just it is, right? Less they're of a man. They're just gay guys. They're just a gay guy. Just kind of mean they're gay. Guys. Yeah. They're trying to be cool by liking chicks too. But nah, they're just gay. But women can be bisexual. But I encourage all women to be bisexual. They should. I think all of them are. <laughs> yeah. That's what that's what the internet's taught me. That's right, man. Mm -hmm. It's good for women to be gay. And it's unacceptable for men. Tomato potato, you know it's what I mean? Balls. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, good for her. I mean, that's fun. Her, that's awesome. That's fun. I'm sure, it's hot. she's a hot girl. I wonder who the guest star will be. Oh yeah, let's take bets. Uh, Millie Bobby Brown. Sure, <laughs> especially whenever this was made. <laughs> Definitely the right time. Uh, oh goodness, Sissy Spacek. Definitely Sissy Spacek. I'm going Halle Berry. Let's see who she's dating? No, no, no. She made out with Adrian Brody in front of her husband on stage at the Oscars. Oh, she's not right. gay. Nope. <laughs> True. Or can she play gay? No, she can't. It's not possible. She can't imagine um, what it would be like. I don't know who. Uh, it'll be... Uh, it'll, Erica Ferreira. It'll be Gina Gershon and Jennifer Tilly. Ooh, I love it. Both. Um, no, that's good, man. That's good. She, uh, she'd be a great bisexual lover, I'd imagine. <laughs> you know. Makes yeah. sense. Uh, that's fun. But no, this is a, this is a fun. This is a real road trip episode. Mm -hmm. It's truly a road trip episode, and the fact that they had such good crunch time about it. A lot of times, road trip comedies can feel stretched out, like the movies. So the fact that this is only like a twenty minute show forces them to really condense stuff, and they use it to great effect. I thought it was really well written, and I thought you know having the motif of how much time is left on it gives a good ticking time clock to it and the reveals that came out like i even love the reveal like i love the way that reveal came out i mean we knew the re what it was but it's been so long i forgot about it <laughs> yeah, yeah, totally. yeah that for it to come to the surface i was like oh that's why he sabotages i didn't even think about that yeah and that's a great like additional layer because like you know it's one of those things you can get an inkling for of like oh maybe he doesn't want this for some mm -hmm. reason or or yeah his heart's not in it but yeah it's not that it's a great opportunity because it was like a couple episodes ago or something I was like wait a minute though there's that whole thing where they made the deal and the leverage yeah. <laughs> and yeah and then I completely forgot and I and I love the long game of that especially on a show like this you know that's mostly episodic yeah they work their serial elements very nicely throughout this. And I thought the road trip bits were actually really funny. Yeah, Nakatomi Plaza was a great the way <laughs> the way that they they still built uh, like a twists and turns around uh, all the sabotaging was really well done too. Planting all these seeds and then when Hold was revealing all of it, that was really well constructed. Mm -hmm. Some of that should have been like, but the Nakatomi Plaza one should be able to see that coming. Oh yeah, 
<laughs> yeah. yeah, it's just like such a such right a like there. a coincidence, such a perfect lightning yeah, strike. Because there was there's such an agreeable thing to him, and when he, when he said we have more time if you want to take more photos, so there was such an agreeable thing when he said that's, that. I was that's like, that's that odd. Weird. <laughs> Is that a character? It seems like you should be in a hurry to get to the yeah. airport regardless. <laughs> but Andre Brower was giving like the perfect performance for this, yeah. and uh, I loved all the boils too. That was a really funny bit. They, they just had some really funny hijinks that were happening here. It was really oh, funny. Yeah. I loved like Scully going to the bathroom and Terry being traumatized. <laughs> that, was really, yeah. that was hilarious. And the RV blowing up because of the cheese puffs. And like Amy being chill is not that funny, but the fact that she got to fully unleash at the yeah. end and reach her maximum potential Slingshot. was great. Yeah, uh-huh. totally. That was excellent. That was a really fun episode. Yeah, I liked it a lot. I feel very warm inside. And and yeah, I like that resolution of like, you know, don't let this, <laughs> I mean, it's a dangerous choice, sure. But also, yeah, I mean, like, you know, go live your dream and, and we'll figure the rest out in real time as it comes, as it happens. Yeah. You know, yeah. That family support feels like it's been well earned over this time. Yeah. And just, yeah, I don't know. I think you're absolutely right. It's like it's got all the benefits of a road trip thing without doing the requisite part of a lot of road trip movies where it really feels like you've just been in the car a long time. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) yeah. It's like you get to bypass that one element that can sometimes drag these things down. And, uh, yeah, it doesn't get bogged down by that. Just stick to the snappy energy. Yeah. And make use of the Nakatomi (laughs) Plaza building on whatever lot that building's on. All righty, guys. Well, Brooklyn Nine-Nine, another episode down. How many are in this season? 20-some-odd. And we call it a week after that. Yeah. Take a breather. And still no Gina. Still no Gina. She, she would have held this episode back. Most certainly. By so much. She would have uh, ruined everything. I'm not missing her. It's kind of a weird sign. It is strange. I mean, I- I'm curious what it'll be like when she comes back but thus then far I'll be like oh i missed her yeah sure <laughs> it'll be it'll be that it'll be like i'm glad to have her back but also i haven't i would be lying if i've said like these episodes have felt like anything was missing <laughs> yeah <laughs> which i feel bad about cuz uh, cuz there are so i remember Gina was was like the slowest character for us to get on board with but has had some like hilarious moments uh but at the same time she often seems to be weaving between plots yeah i don't know I don't know. It's curious. We'll see when they bring her back. All righty, guys. Well, leave your thoughts down below. Tell us your nitpicks. We'll talk with you all soon.